Asphalt art has been a topic of discussion in the city for somewhere around 15 years. Um, but in 2020, our, our friends and partners in Bike for Collins um, began to coordinate some community engagement where the community started to, to come together on the idea of asphalt art. Street murals are a really great tool, not only for reshaping our built environment and uh, place making and street beautification um, and ultimately traffic calming, but they're also a great way for communities to come together and talk about how we use the space and what the issues are and what the concerns are. And then to work on something together and, and see that what we can create in a day when we all come together. Bike Fort Collins has really admired the work of the City Repair Project in Portland, Oregon. We worked to help bring together the transportation folks from the City of Portland with the transportation folks here in Fort Collins to really start that conversation. And then the city said, hey, like, let's make this a formal process. And so they started the Asphalt Art Program. And then we, as Bike Fort Collins, started looking at problem intersections where street murals could be used um, for traffic calming and place making and street beautification. I wanted to connect the, the history from the, the sugar beet farmers and the generations of family that still live there from the farmers that had worked in the sugar beet farms. So that's why that one was kind of towards, you know, more sugar beet and the, and the short hose. Connects it to, to the, the sculpture that was just put up with the hand holding the, the short hoe. That's why that one looks like that. I still wanted to make it as colorful so both murals actually have, um, are using the exact same colors. And this one, the people in the community really wanted um, a face, somebody or, or something. And I thought Frida Kahlo would be perfect just because she's very recognizable. That like Latin figure where they can be proud of it and other people who see it can also be like, oh, that's Frida Kahlo. And what we really want is for the community to lead and drive these projects and for the city to really take a, a back seat where we can maybe provide some logistics planning and to help to, to coordinate to some degree. But really we'd like the community to, to take these projects and these ideas and run with them.